Hey there guys, it's Rick Usler again. This is our sixth and final episode of this season of Going Ballistic, and we've saved something. I think you guys are gonna like it. So we've already talked about all these cool lethal pellets. We've talked about the polymags, uh, all the way up to the big board polymags. We've talked about the Hades and 2225. We've talked about the 22 cal knockout slugs. Well, guess what? We've got 25 cal knockout slugs, and that's what we're gonna talk about today. These are so new, we don't even have a label on the tin. Now, by the time you see this, they're probably gonna be readily available. We were very tickled to have the opportunity to kind of get out there and do some testing with these right out of the gate. Now we're shooting these in the Raptor, and I've mentioned this a lot through this series. The reason we went with the Raptor is because we could shoot the same gun in every single caliber. It's just a very quick and simple changeover, change the pellet pusher, change the barrel, use a different magazine, and you're up and running. That to me is awesome. If you need more power, easily externally adjustable regulator. It makes, it makes air gunning fun for me. I love the fact that I can have all of this adjustability, you know, as far as power and hammer throw and all that other stuff. I never even have to take the gun apart and it's no big deal to change calibers. ATN optics, I talk about that a lot. I love what that scope brings to the table. I love being able to record right what I'm seeing. And I love the fact that I have that one shot zero moving from gun to gun or pellet to pellet. Getting back dead center right on target is super easy, I love it. And if we wanna see what we're shooting, we wanna see the results we're getting, we gotta have some really good medium. Clear ballistics, as far as I'm concerned, has the best stuff. Super clear, reusable if you wanna do it. Just really, really good stuff. Now, it's all about though the pellets because all of this stuff is great, but if you don't have anything to put in it and shoot down range, it, you're just staring at some really cool stuff. But fortunately, Predator International has some really cool pellets and slugs. And today we're talking about that 25 cal knockout slug. Let's put something into perspective here. This slug, I got some cheat notes here because I need them. Uh, we're looking at 33.95 grains, so that's a pretty heavy slug in a 25. It's pretty good, good weight. Now we're pushing that slug at 960 feet per second, and that is just like on a base setting. If I wanted to make that go 1100, I could probably do it in this gun, but just at that base setting, 960, we're getting nearly 70 foot-pounds. So that's nearly 70 foot-pounds on target, and this is what happens with these slugs at that velocity you just get just total head expansion. It doesn't peel back, it doesn't separate, it stays together, all of the mass stays in one place, but it just creates a wall, and all of that energy dumps because it just opens up and just stays flat. Take a look at what's happening in the gel here. So we have all of these different slow motion camera angles, and you can see it just hits and hits and hits. Take a look at what we're getting in the gel with the 25 cal knockout slugs. So if we're looking here, you can see very clearly that the slugs are devastating. And if we have them here on the table, just look at that. I'm gonna pick this one up because it's just awesome. But if you take a look at that, it just opens up so completely and retains all of its mass. So when you have that impact, you get the maximum advantage of that projectile. So what does that mean in the field? It means that game, if your gun shoots them accurately, probably game out to maybe 300 yards. <laughs> it, 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 trying to process that for a minute. But an air gun, being able to take game at 300 yards, that's what these slugs are gonna let you do. We're talking about retaining a lot of energy, and if your gun shoots them accurately, retaining that accuracy as well. Just an awesome option for you guys that wanna hunt and shoot long range. You now have these slugs 
now in 25 caliber. Guys, that's gonna be it for this season of Going Ballistic. I gotta say thank you to everybody, especially gotta say thank you to Predator International because they really stepped up and made this happen. Of course, thanks to all of our other sponsors too for all of their support. What are we gonna do next? I'm not sure, but you know how the air gun world is. There's always something new right around the corner, and I'm hoping we'll be able to bring it to you in our next season of Going Ballistic. Guys, that's it for now. My name's Rick Usler. Thanks for watching.